Hey guys, welcome back to the 164 Show. My name is Peter. I am your host and welcome to another special episode of the 164 Show in Malaysia. Now before we begin today's episode, I just want to say a quick thank you to our ongoing sponsors kovodisplays.com.au so if you're looking to get your hot wheels collection to the next level and you want to have it displayed on the wall on your cabinet on the cupboard or on top of your cupboard or your table wherever you want to display your hot wheels collections kovodisplays.com.au has that selection for you and for your hot wheels as well so whether you're looking for your short card collections, your long card red line clubs, or convention cards, or you want to stack them into 30 cards, 15 cards, all in one acrylic case. So koboldisplays.com.au is the place to go. They do ship worldwide. So don't worry, not just exclusive to Australians and for New Zealanders. Anyway, let's get into today's episode. So today's episode, we're actually going to go on a little adventure to find a vending machine. So there's one very close to where I'm staying here in Puchong or Kuala Lumpur. And all I want to do in this little trip to a supermarket called Lotus is to just try what a vending machine for Hot Wheels actually looks and feels like and what you do or what you get. Um, I've already, well, of course, I've already been on this adventure and can really tell you that it's a hit and miss, but you'll find out why it's such a hit and miss. Let's go. So today we're here at uh, a place called Lotus. It used to be a Tesco. So uh, our UK viewers might know Tesco. The reason why I'm here is that it's so close to our house. And I heard that there is a vending machine here. So I'm going to have a, a quick look see if I can find a Hot Wheels vending machine and see what kind of goodies I can find in there, if any. And also just check out this shop, this big shop here. So come with me, let's go on a little adventure. Yeah, check this out guys, so we have found it. Um, so the older set boulevards sit here. Nothing spectacularly interesting. That Snoopy at the top looks pretty interesting. And there's an X-Men at the top. I really can't see what else there is. Oh, there's Fast and Furious at the back. Um, I don't know, maybe a few people might be interested in the uh, the Datsun Hardbody D21. I'm not a big fan. Okay, so for the experience, I'll grab that Snoopy. What is it? 05. Okay, so what notes do they take? So they take 10 and 20 to make 30 but they also take a 50 as well Oh yeah, so you press the what you need first and then the balance goes up. Should be. Okay. 
they accept my note and then I put my 20 in and yep the balance went up to 30 and there's my card damage great so there we go we have the Rolling Thunder Snoopy for 30 ringgit which is about 10 New Zealand dollars um, not much else going on in here very curious what the other ones are at the back very hard to see you can see at the camera maybe Yeah, so first vending machine experience. Uh, not very happy how, how it just drops. It should it might easily come up. But uh, anyway, got one. All right, let's check out the rest of the shop. Matchbox. Oh, where's the good stuff? Where's the Hot Wheels? Oh my god, look at this. <coughs> Not interesting at all. <laughs> A few color changes. So, Purple Passion 19, which is about 6 or 7 New Zealand dollars. This is interesting. <laughs> Some cheapy 164 diecast for three ringgit, which is like less than a dollar, maybe just just a dollar NZD. Got the range here. Look, all fantasy cars. <coughs> it's been like crumbled, worn. Um, but 590 is pretty cheap if you want toys for the kids. Is there anything else that's interesting? Oh, this is cool. Bone shakers. Uh, what ratio is this? Like 143? Oh. Anyway, it's cool, but nothing of interest to me. I mean, the matchbox is done really nicely. But there's not much of interest in terms of matchbox and that's it for toy section all right so i hope you guys enjoyed that quick look into the lotus superstore here in malaysia and then a chance to see a vending machine in action um yeah can't get a mint card in vending machines they'll drop it Cop corners are all going to be soft chance of blister damage um, yeah but hope you guys enjoyed it into a good into a look into that and catch you guys again next time thank you